tree's coming towards you, but <laughs> content! Let's get this big shit. Content! We were all left in shock yesterday by the explosion in Beirut. Lebanon's Prime Minister Hassan Diab said that 2,750 tons of ammonium nitrate, a highly explosive material used in fertilizers and bombs, had been stored for six years at a port warehouse without safety measures, endangering the safety of citizens. Around 300,000 people have been displaced from their homes due to the explosion. God, that's so sad. Did you see the video to that? I did. It was one of the craziest things I have seen in a long time. I hope everyone's okay. Isaias, the Category 1 hurricane that hit the East Coast on Tuesday, quickly weakened to a tropical storm once it hit land. However, it still left a trail of floods, fires, and many people without electricity. Governor Roy Cooper of North Carolina said that the damage was not as great as it could have been. The storm continued north, causing over 1.2 million people to be without power in Virginia, Maryland, Delaware, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and New York. There is a lot of videos, too, of people just being outside and um, taking like pictures of trees falling. Have you seen yeah. those? No, I haven't seen those. I saw all of the cars in the streets like Crazy. just flooded. I know. And then there's also like I don't know if you follow influencers in the wild, but there's people out there. That's a title. Is yes, that... it's an Instagram thing, and there's people worried about getting content than their safety. <laughs> yeah, they're like, it's like literally Drake saying like, uh, yeah. he's got a saying in his song or something like, do it for the content, yes. like risk your life. Do it for the, yeah, something like that. I was just like, okay, <laughs> tree's coming towards you, but <laughs> content, Let's get this picture. content. <laughs> well, he may not be able to say Yosemite correctly. Yosemites, Yosemites, towering sequoias. The president did just sign the Great American Outdoors Act. What does that mean? It means that there will be up to $1.9 billion per year for five years to fund deferred maintenance projects identified by the National Park Service and other wildlife and land management groups. We may not be able to agree on the stimulus bill, but I'm glad we can at least agree that national parks are important to us. I love national parks. I do too. They're so pretty and peaceful. Just don't feed the animals. What? You don't feed animals? You're not supposed to. Oh, I thought that's like one of the... Okay, we're not in Yogi Bear, okay? <laughs> They're not friendly like that. If you've watched the Ibble Bits show before, I'm assuming you have, you would know that Mulan, Disney's live adaptation, was delayed indefinitely. Well, now we finally have a release date, y'all. Mulan will be available on Disney Plus for $30 on September 4th. This marks an interesting turn in the movie industry and is yet to be seen if Mulan will perform the way Disney needs it to. Mulan is my favorite movie ever, and I know you haven't seen it, Tanner. Like, that breaks my heart, okay? I know. I, I'm going to watch the new one. Just you so. do. It's on Netflix. Even though it's $30. Look, we, why don't we just split it? I already paid for Disney+. Plus. Good idea. Have you been using sanitizing wipes more than usual during the pandemic? I'm sure you have, but if so, you should slow down a little bit. Clorox wipes won't be fully in stock until 2021. CEO Ben Oderno said disinfecting wipes, which are the hottest commodity in the business right now, will probably take longer because it's a very complex supply chain to make them. There are way too many Clorox wipes hanging around my house. I have so many too, like hello Hopefully Costco. They, yeah, I know. Hopefully they last until 2021 though. I mean, I'm not dirty, so it's Fine. Yeah. Do you do you wipe down like everything after I somebody do, comes over? But I use um, so I'm half Hispanic and I grew up in a house of pine salt. So if your house didn't smell like pine salt, it's not clean. So mm. I use that mm. more. It's... I think that's probably why I have so many Clorox wipes. If you need some Clorox wipes, I have some. <laughs> you can start. You can sell them on the black market. <laughs> I won't do that because that's messed up. Maybe like because <laughs> that's messed that's up. That's so messed up. Like I don't like people like that taking advantage of that's not cool. Who's ready for college football season? Well, it may not be happening this year, unfortunately. UConn is the first FBS football team to announce that they will be canceling their football season due to the COVID. Huskies football coach Randy Edsall said that he consulted his players before the university made its decision. UConn has been one of the most cash-strapped athletics departments in the FBS. I'm so sad about that. I miss football. I know. I don't really watch it, so I don't really care. I am really <laughs> into football. Like, it's... I, even if it's a team I don't like, it's my background noise because I just can't sit in silence, but that and I get fantasy teams. Fan wow, you're deep in I'm it. all in, man. Wow. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to the Ibble Bits Show, the best daily news show on YouTube. If you like the show, make sure to like this video and subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to download our app. It's pretty awesome. Stay classy and sassy. See you next time. Bye. Bye.